guys it's gloria welcome back to tinker wonderland today i am going to show you how i made my pinakbet it's a filipino uh, dish that is really uh, famous in our country and um and it's like a mixture a lot of mixture of uh, vegetables that i really really love and i miss it and i finally found uh at least more uh types of vegetables that uh supposed to be in it so here we go guys again it's gloria and uh, you are watching tinker wonderland and welcome to gloria's kitchen now here we go guys so here are the ingredients that i have for my pinak bet and like i said this is a famous polyphenol dish in the philippines and uh, i miss having this and finally i went to the um asian store recently and i finally found uh, most of the vegetables that i need for this dish but uh, of course i will add some uh, pork this is a little bit of pork it's like one eight <laughs> so yeah i'm going to uh, saute this with my onion right here there's an onion and i will also add uh, garlic then i have the eggplant here we call this uh in a, we call this talong in the Philippines. Right here, I have bitter gourd. Yes, it's a bitter gourd, guys. Uh, my One of my favorite. And uh, we call this um, palaya in the Philippines. On this side, we have this one is long beans. And we call this sitaw. Sitaw in the Philippines, in Tagalog uh, language. And... On this one we have here is the squash so yeah I'm going to make this all together guys in um, my pot for my supper tonight just keep watching and by the way we call cal we call this squash as calabasa in the Philippines and or in, I mean in Tagalog language and I'm also going to add of course um, a little bit of salt to uh, put taste on the put more flavor on this uh, dish and before I forget uh, watch the entire video so you can see or uh, you can hear what I mentioned for the emoticons or emojis that I want for our giveaway so stick with me here we go guys so I am trying to uh, warm up the or heat up the oil here in my uh, pot I'm going to add my onion now and then of course some of my minced garlic here now I will add the pork and I'm just going to uh, saute this until golden brown And there you go guys as you can see the pork is brown now it turns brown so i'm just going to add all these vegetables already just like that it's not it's so easy to make that guys so i'm just gonna add all of that mix it all in and then i will add water until it uh all, all vegetables and the meat will cook and then instead of using salt, I, I uh, just realized I have this fish sauce. So I'm going to uh, uh, use this fish sauce to add more, more flavor to my inakbet. So that's how it looks, guys. So this is how it looks like guys and we'll just add some water so it won't get burned so the vegetables starting to cook i will just let that boil or simmer until everything is cooked and that's our, all about it guys it's gonna be done and i'll be ready for supper <laughs> so i'm just gonna soak all the vegetables in water 
let it boil and this is really really good guys but if you're not uh, if you are not um, good in eating bitter bitter vegetables or like like this bitter gourd uh, you can just leave that but uh, for me I that's one of my favorite I really like it so yeah just gonna let that boil I will add some of this uh, fish sauce that I got from the Asian store so here is my fish sauce guys I just used the use the lid of the bottle of course guys before I forget I want you to give me uh sunflower emoticons or uh, yes sunflower emo emoticons yeah sunflower emoticons for our giveaway thank you for watching so measure it you don't want to put more of this because it's going to be uh, salty so just add it there and as you can see it's boiling now and it's going to be done in a little bit all right so there you go guys my pinak bit is ready now everything is cooked everything is well done my uh, vegetables are now all done and of course the pork is also done so it's gonna be ready for plating i will turn off my my uh, stove and it's it will be ready for plating and uh, we're gonna eat Now here is my uh, pinak bit guys. It's a mixture of uh, bitter gourd, squash, long beans, uh, eggplant, and a little bit of uh, pork. And yeah, it's yummy. It's gonna be so yummy guys. Come on, let's eat with me. Look how it looks. Look how it looks. <laughs> So that's how it looks, guys. Yummy. That is my simple supper for tonight. With, of course, I also have tilapia. So I'm gonna eat this with tilapia in this vegetables. Awesome. Come on, let's eat, guys. Thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoy watching this video. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up give me a thumbs up share comment and subscribe share comment and subscribe on this channel thinker wonderland until the next video guys thank you all for watching have a good day and a good night god bless everyone bye bye for now i'll see you on the next vlog guys for watching have a good day and a good night and guys you can also follow me on facebook at gloria custodio that gardener and on instagram at chi gardener that 26 and um also don't forget to, to subscribe on this channel tinker wonderland and also click the bell button next to it so you won't miss any of our video and guys always remember Every day is a blessing, so we start your day with a smile. God bless everyone. Thank you all for your love and support since day one. And I will see you on the next vlog.